All right, got it up and running. Everything's calibrated. It's uh, cycling through each zone one at a time for one minute. There's five zones for the lawn. The other ones are just stubbed out. You might see the little blue pipe sticking up that's stub outs for future flower beds. I'll uh, hide those pipes, bury them eventually. It's a pretty awesome system. I'm really, really happy. It's just, there's definitely ways to do this without as many sprinkler heads, but you get a much more even watering when each head can touch the other head and it's just really cool how Rainbird designed this for me and I just followed their instructions so so everywhere you don't see the dark soil is not gonna be a lawn so it's kind of like a big bean shape that goes over there and up and then partially up on the slope here but everywhere you see the dry dirt is going to be uh, just um, flower beds. I've got seed down too. If you can see it, zoysia seed are very small. You can see a few there. Um, so yeah, it's cycling to zone three now. So it's, it's on the third. Worn out. I'm gonna do some steps down to the grass eventually, so it'll be steps probably the width of these first two posts here. Some just easy steps down to the grass level. Right over there where it does that last bend is going to be the entrance to Rachel's garden, which will be over here. So now it's doing the zones back there. These wheel marks were my spreader that I was spreading seed. I did that 10 foot widths, but you, you can't see them in left to right direction, but they were also done left to right. But. I put it on the lowest setting possible and just did as many passes as I could so that it would uh, be as even spreading as, as possible. It's really cool though, it feels great. You know, it's been a ton of long nights up till dark working out here raking I don't know if you can see over there, it's massive piles of debris. Um, it, it, I don't know if anybody's familiar with my cart that I tow behind my lawnmower with. I think it's like 12 cubic feet, 10 cubic feet, something like that. Uh, I think it was 10 full raked up sticks and debris, 10 full cartloads of that that Rachel and I did. It was insane. We didn't do it over here, so it was just all full of rock and sticks and, you know, this is an acre of grass is what it's going to be. It was bonkers, but... That's the final zone back there that's running and then it'll be done. But yeah, there it goes, just finished, so. 
That was one minute at each zone. And very thankful. But just thought I'd show you if you're interested.